The director of the National Institute of Mental Health, Dr. Tom Insel, recently said that we're going to have a whole new psychiatry down the road. And, it, and the way psychiatry classifies, it, classifies diseases and disorders nowadays will become obsolete. And I think he's right. But I don't think it's right around the corner. I think eventually we will know so much about how the brain works and how parts of the brain work. And we'll have all kinds of neuroimaging and we'll have genetic testing. So psychiatry will be a lot more like cardiology or kidney uh, disease, uh, nephrology, uh, the, the specialists. And instead of having concepts like post-traumatic stress disorder, we'll understand exactly how uh, perhaps the amygdala, the cingulate gyrus, certain brain circuitry is connected to the autonomic nervous system and how the cycles are disrupted by extreme trauma, and we'll define it in very different ways. It won't be an overall syndrome. We'll know that there's a specific flaw or a specific condition, and there are more medically oriented remedies. And there'll still be a need for psychologists, for social workers, to help people who have various medical system disorders cope with those disorders, uh, how they can best be rehabilitated. But I think psychiatry will eventually become a medical specialty a lot closer to neurology, and that'll be an advance.